Hello there, everybody. It is I, Waddles, here on It's Dangerous Take This. I know, a little confusing, but welcome back or welcome. Today, I'm going to show you how to make a cow farm. This is going to be a super, super easy cow farm. Like, you can easily make this within, like, probably your first five days. But it's not going to automatically cook the food for you. But you will get a bunch of leather and a bunch of raw beef. So it'll be pretty useful for you. So if this tutorial helps you, leave a like, maybe even subscribe. And check out some of my other videos if you're curious. Little disclaimer, I don't claim to have invented this design. I believe it may have been Impulse SV who invented or discovered this design so I'll link his video in the description I just wanted to make a video on it because I've been getting a lot of questions on this design because this is the design I use in my let's play series should work 1.11 plus and I think on the console but I'm not too sure let me know if you're on console and it works or it doesn't work and I think I've said everything I need to let's do this tutorial what are you going to need to make this super, super easy cow farm? What you're going to need is a bucket of water, a dispenser, six blocks, any kind, doesn't have to be oak wood, a staircase, a button, a hopper, a chest, and a fence. That is all you're going to need, and obviously some cows. You're going to need some cows, so go find some cows somewhere. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to build the farm first, and then I'll explain how it all works, just in case you just want to see the farm built. But how do we build the farm? Super easy. Find a flat area or a mountain area. It's not very big at all, and dig down like a little staircase like that, and a little a bit more. Now place your chest just right there then right behind it a hopper then go right back while you're super dizzy try and stay still and put an upside down stair on top of that uh chest there then break those two blocks that i just broke and stack the wood up like that very very easy and then break this block now this is where it's really tricky but i i think you can do this go inside of here and put a dispenser your only dispenser facing inwards be very careful because just be careful uh but there you go that's the farm but then you have this extra button so throw that on there and then put your water bucket inside of the dispenser press the button and you should have water isn't that magic while holding on tightly to that oak fence that you have but you didn't use yet go and find those cows that you totally didn't spawn because that would totally be cheating you just found these cows standing in the desert and take your wheat get their attention make them want you once you have their attention bring them back to your farm and now you have to get these two cows inside you need at least two because you're going to need to breed the cows obviously so how you get them in is a little tricky but not really it just takes some some patience get them to jump up on top of the block kind of like how I did then jump up on that same block and hold shift or crouch or whatever and just slowly inch and push these cows towards the center of the block eventually they're gonna fall down into the middle that's exactly what you want but obviously you don't want to fall in there be really careful because if you fall in there you gotta break the block and the cows might get out and it'll just be a problem okay now that you have two cows in there really quick go really super fast and put that fence right over it uh you actually don't have to go fast they're not going to get out but put the fence over it to keep them from getting out and that is the farm that's the whole farm and if that's all you needed you're welcome hope you enjoyed subscribe i'll see you around but if you want to know how it works this part is for you so first i should say how to use it what you're going to want to do is when you want to breed these cows press the button so they float up and then literally just walk over and use the wheat on them you know feed them both they'll breed press the button to make them stop floating and then you'll have a baby cow in there and you're going to repeat that process until you have 24 exactly if you have any more than 24 the farm is broken i'm totally kidding you need at least 24 because this works on the new kind of rule that was added in or not really rule but kind of game mechanic that sets an entity cap at 24 on a particular block and this is just basically in simple terms if you want to check out the full description go to impulse sv's video once you go over 24 cows in this block over here then cows will start dying and their remains will go into the chest and then you can do whatever you want with their remains kind of cruel but it's how it works 
And kind of interestingly, the game will choose to kill the adults over the babies, so that is why this works. So basically what I'll do in my Let's Play world is I'll come over to the farm, breed all the adults, and then just wait. Let them all die, all of their stuff goes in here, and then I'll come back in maybe about five minutes or whatever, and all the babies will now be grown up, and I do it again. I don't ever really breed the adults when there's any babies in there. It just makes it a bit of a hassle. And in case you're wondering how to tell that there's no baby cows in there, if you press the water, turn the water on so you can breed them, you'll see the baby cows bobbing up and down. Or you'll just hear the baby cows. Their sound is a little different. But basically, that's the whole farm. And if you didn't realize by now, this would work with sheep and pigs too. So do what you wish with it. Maybe you have a sheep farm and you just get all the wool like that instead of shearing them I don't know you choose what you want to do with it but I hope this helped you out I know I didn't explain all of the mechanics of the game very well so again if you really really want to know the technicalities go to the wiki go to the developers page and look at the 1.11 update notes go to impulse SV's video it will be in the description and thank you so much for watching I hope this helped you hope you learned something new if you're absolutely curious to see this thing in action maybe you think hey this doesn't work go check out my let's play series it's totally vanilla and I use this a lot and I think that's all I gotta say so thank you so much for watching any questions throw them in the comments I'll try and get back to you and I'll see you next time this has been Waddles I will see you later